hi this is Sheeta Hunter in this quick video I'm going to show you how to add multiple partitions to a single hard drive it's sort of like dividing a hard drive into several drives for different uses so here are the steps first of all I have disk utility open and I have my hard drive mounted onto my desktop on the left hand column here you'll see that the drive is selected and presently it's showing me the one partition that's inside of this drive. It's labeled Acme Files and it is the basically the full capacity or full size of the hard drive right now, you know, minus some system files. So what I would like to do is divide this up into two additional partitions so that I can use each partition as a separate quote drive on my desktop for different uses. So once I select the drive itself, not the partition, you want to select the drive, I'm going to click on the partition button at the top of the disk utility window. It gives you the options of um, how to reformat or not reformat, how to add more partitions. So presently it's showing me the Acme files partition. I want to make that partition a certain size. So what I'm going to do is first of all below this circle that shows you the capacity of the partition I'm going to click on the plus sign so what it just did it took that Acme files partition and equally divided it into two I want the Acme files partition to actually only be a certain size I want it to be just 25 gigs so I'm going to go down to the size fill and type in 25 and then press tab and my menu here is already set to gigabytes so I didn't have to uh, change that but you see you have the different options of kilobytes megabytes and so forth so let's leave that at gigabytes so now my Acme partition file size is going to be 25 gigabytes and I have a untitled partition over here of roughly just slightly less than 35 but I wanna point out that if I do already have files on this Acme files partition I can repartition without losing those files you do want to back up first always back up first before you do anything like this but repartitioning a drive if there's adequate amount of space the files that are already on the drive will be left in place they won't be harmed but you need to make sure that you have enough space for repartitioning your drives so here I want to take the untitled side and I actually want to divide it up even more so let me do this let me name this side first I'm going to name this a F G files and I'm going to divide that up into 20 gigabytes and I'm going to press the tab key to apply that so I have the AGF files I have the Acme files and I have an untitled file let's change untitled and let's name that P whoops POP files so now I'm going to select the apply button and disk utility is going to go through the process of partitioning up this one hard drive into three separate partitions and then it's going to mount each partition on to my desktop so let's give it a minute and I'm going to click on the show details and with show details it'll tell you exactly what it's doing but you don't necessarily uh, need to expand that button so let's give it a few more seconds and it should be done shortly and there we are so now if I look at the hard drive on the left hand side you see that I have three partitions Acme files AGF files and POP files and off to the right you see those different uh, partition icons on my desktop so I can use them for separate things and can you partition up a startup disk yes you can so I hope this uh, quick tutorial was helpful this is Sheeta Hunter until next time